The latest series in the installation is from 1980, and it's part of a project called the Los Angeles Documentary Survey Project that Robert Flick participated in. And at the time, he was really frustrated with the single viewpoint common in American landscape photography. And he wanted to convey a more experiential understanding of the Los Angeles landscape, which is sort of defined by its sprawlingness, by the juxtaposition of man-made forms and the natural landscape and that kind of vernacular architecture that you find in Southern California. So he came up with this idea that would be a kind of performance where he walked down the street at prescribed intervals and photographed from certain directions. Um, and then he would take the negatives, develop them, and then use this kind of manual layout technique um, from graphic design at the time in a pre-digital age um, and made 10 rows of 10 images each in, for the final print. So you get a sense of moving through time and space and a more kind of uh, episodic understanding of space or as we naturally experience the landscape, we see it in sort of dribs and drabs and make associations with certain uh, ideas or forms in the landscape, and these pictures give us a, a closer approximation of that experience. He was really interested in conceptual art at the time, so this idea of performing a set of instructions is very important to this work as well.